Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product every day series. Today I'm going to be trying out a product from a brand that is new to me that I had not heard of before I got this in my June 2021 BoxyCharm Premium Box. So this is from a brand called Floss Beauty and this here is the Concierge Cheek and Lip Tint. So if you have not seen my June 2021 BoxyCharm Premium Unboxing, I'll have that video linked in the description down below. But I love trying out new brands. So I'm really excited to learn about this brand. It's cruelty-free, vegan. This retails for $22. I got it in the shade Sandals, but looking on their website, it comes in three different shades. It says it's a hydrating cheek and lip tint for an effortless beachy vibe. Formulated for convenience and ease of use, these weatherproof, no brush needed tints blend seamlessly into the skin for all day wear. Apply directly onto the cheeks and lips and blend it out with the tips of your fingers. Sounds really cool. And I like the packaging on this. It seems high end, like a like a metal type of packaging almost. But oh, it's it's a lot like a lipstick. Wow. Yeah, it doesn't have any smell to it that I'm noticing. Before I apply it to my lips or cheeks, I'm gonna go ahead and do a swatch. Whoa, okay, that is very pigmented. That basically just reminds me of a lipstick, like a twist up lipstick. First, I'll try applying it to my lips, but I definitely want to build up the pigment. So it's supposed to be a tint. So let's see if I just go in with a little bit, not even applying it directly to my lips. I'm just gonna pick some up on my finger here. And let's see. Oh, I actually really like that shade. It's very similar to my natural lip color. And it does blend super easily. That is actually a beautiful lip tint right there. It looks like even color. A nice wash of color. And it's kind of moisturizing on the lips as well. Ooh. Now, I am not much of a lip tint person. I do prefer more of a full opaque color. But so, this is the lip tint. Let's go ahead and layer it up. Okay, applying it directly to the lips, this is actually a beautiful formula. It feels like a very creamy lip balm, but it has really beautiful pigment. Like when I hear something described as a tint, I can pretty much assume it's barely gonna show up and barely have any pigment. But this, like look at that on the lips, that is full opaque color and it's such a beautiful shade. I love this. That's actually like a, a go-to neutral nude shade for me. I'm loving it. And it does have like a cream to matte finish, but it looks beautiful on the lips. It's not clinging to the dry patches. My lips look smoothed out, even color. Okay, I am very much impressed by this. If this was even just described as a lipstick, I would be like, this is beautiful, I love it. But now let's see how it looks on the cheek. Hmm, do I wanna apply it directly to my cheek or, you know, let's be safe. I'm just gonna start out by just picking up a little bit on my finger again and blending it out on the cheek. I love the color so much on my lips. Let's hope that I love it on the cheek as well. I feel like I will because this is looking so pretty. Seriously blends out so easily and it's looking very smooth, creamy on the cheek. It also almost adds a little bit of radiance like because of that smooth, creamy texture. And it's sitting nicely on top of my foundation as well. 
Okay, that's that's really pretty. I like that a lot. It's a very natural flush of color type of shade for me. I really love this shade called Sandals because it's very similar to my natural lip color and very natural of a blush shade as well. So perfect. So without it, with it, it looks so even. It looks so smooth and natural. Exactly what I would hope for. It does take some time working at it to blend it out on the cheek if you are going to use your fingers like this, but eventually it works out and it's not leaving finger marks. I'll apply it a little bit less on this cheek. I feel like I always go overboard at first, so this is a lot. This is probably where I want to be with the amount of blush. But I'm really happy with this shade overall, but it also like it just looks so natural cohesive with My skin like you can't detect that I'm wearing a blush even the shade looks like such a natural healthy flush of color so Beautiful, I'm curious about the transfer on the lipstick. So let's see Wow, yeah, that's a lot of transfer, but it does have such a creamy feel to it that I'm not surprised that is very pigmented because it is still completely intact, full color on my lips still, even after all of that transfer. So yay, I had so much fun with this product. I love the multi-use of it. I think it's a beautiful cream blush, a beautiful lip tint, and a beautiful just full-on lipstick. And I'm so happy with this shade. I feel like this is just perfect very summery beachy like it claims but also i feel like this shade is perfect for year round so yay now i feel so excited about this brand floss beauty and of course i want to try out more products so if you've tried any floss beauty products definitely let me know your thoughts on them let me know your recommendations in the comments down below and thank you so much for watching my video today be sure to like comment and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day and I will see you tomorrow in my next video.